Okay, what we're doing today is we're making a top light for a TARDIS. Uh, it's for a costume for a friend of mine for Comic-Con this weekend. And uh, we're using this little RGB LED strip here. Uh, we've got a little plastic jar to actually serve as the top there. We're going to cram some of this in there and then hot glue it. And then I've built a little driver circuit we're going to zoom in on here. And that driver circuit uh, hooks up to the LED strip and drives it at the bottom here. You'll see there's a little MOSFET. And that MOSFET is driven by a 555 timer, which is hooked to a capacitor and a resistor that provides the timing for it, and then I'll get hooked to a little itty bitty little 11-volt uh, battery. Here's the TARDIS top going. Uh, you can see I've used three different colors there. I got them all going to try and get it to white, but it gives a gives a kind of a nice thing going there. It's a very simple timer circuit that drives the LED. the TARDIS hat uh, built. It's a, just a little fascinator. Uh, this is the light here in the top. Flip it over, and you can see there's a spot there for the electronics to go, and the wires are sticking out. We we'll solder it together, and we'll test it out. Now you can see we've got it soldered onto the back of the circuit there. We're gonna plug in the battery, and then if that works, uh, we'll go ahead and hot glue it in. All right, we've got the battery plugged into it now, and it's looking pretty good. Uh, I think it's time to go ahead and hot glue it down. Here's the finished uh, assembly of the inside of the TARDIS hat. Uh, the PC board there has been hot glued in, and then over onto the side here, we've got some Velcro there for the battery to connect to. Everything's secured down real good. It doesn't really generate any heat because it's not very, uh, it doesn't use very much electricity. Uh, the battery we're using is a very small here, uh, three cell LiPo. You can see it's not much bigger than the quarter that's sitting next to it. So once we plug that in, you can see what the finished Here's product Here's the completed like. TARDIS hat. You can see the light does exactly what we want it to do. It's a very simple circuit, just a 555 timer with one MOSFET to drive it and then a capacitor and a resistor to set the timing on it. So it turned out really, really well. If you'd like to see it in person, look for the girl in the TARDIS dress at uh, Denver Comic Con this weekend. Enjoy.